Hey there, it's that mama, and we have some new levels for this newbie baby. She has created a couple more levels since I stopped doing this. I stopped on level 15, and we are ready for level 16. So first of all, you need your group tag on so that when you res your baby, the baby will not disappear again. So go ahead and get that done. Then you'll need your HUD on. I've got mine set up in the favorites wearables, but wherever in your inventory you have it, add it. So up on the screen. And once that gets all resed in, you'll have this. You'll have this little baby icon up here, so you can push that. That will bring up a blue screen over here to the right and say my babies and press the particular baby you want to work with. I only have one, silly on it. So you click that and it will come into view as a little pet cloud and you say yes. I want to accept the attachment. And she is there on the floor on her own. You can wander around, go and play, do everything she get picked up right now and you can shrink this away like that and I'm actually going to click on her we're going to go levels and we're going to do new gym my gym was a day one and you can always check what kind of gym you have by going to the levels in the Animus Baby HUD, and it will tell you what you have available. I have one, zero of these, zero of that. It tells you how many days it takes. And then once you press on the purchase button, it will tell you in a blue box how much it is to purchase it. So we have one available. So I am going to do the day one. So you push on day one. It's going to give you a little warning message saying this cannot be undone you'll say yes she's day one and she's going to sit down and open up a little box right over our feet <laughs> that's okay it'll still work so yay there's her box And there's the crystal. Now if I stand up here out of the way, we can move this little box and she can move around anywhere she wants to move. She can go and play with toys. She doesn't have to sit here at this learning box. That's what's a little different about this. And it does take 24 hours. So we can go like this. We can drag it over here. And we can also have her come and play with some of her toys like this. And she can get up and play and do other things while she is learning from this box. So for 24 hours, we just gotta sit and wait. <laughs> if you did it for longer, then you gotta sit and wait for longer. But we are going to go ahead and come back and show what is going to happen in level 16. Be back in 24 hours. It's that mama. Hey there, it's that mama. And I'm back to um, show you little Liliana's level up. Now we took out this, here's this, we took that out of the box and as usual, um, you usually get the little tongs out on the sides when it's doing certain things. Well this one is all one box. Um, it was a diamond one so it only took me one day but it gave me a little message after the 24 hours. It says your baby has leveled up 
please use the level menu in your baby and click finish level to see what she has learned. And then you may now delete this box. I'm going to go ahead and click her first and find out what she's learned. This is a little bit different process than we've done it before. She usually sits below it and does all the little thought processes and then the learning. Oh, look at that. She gave me a little kissy. Aww. She's kind of in a bad mood right now. I don't got her all leveled up. So, okay, let's try to get zoomed in on her. My camera will cooperate. And we're going to give her a little tap on the head. See if we can get her thing to show up. Here it is. And we go to levels. And then we go finish level. And it looks like... Let's see, the last thing she did was like, here's number 15. Oh, a tantrum, number 16. Let's do the last summary, last summary button and see what information it gives us. Eliana is level 16, is now able to throw a tantrum. So we can watch her throw a tantrum. No appropriate item was found nearby, so one will be res shortly. Please wait. So, she's on a little pad. <laughs> Whoa. Look at that little kicker and screamer. <laughs> Let's see if it... Oh, she's doing it again. <laughs> so I'll do that over and over. Let's see if we can make her stop. We can make her leave. And so she'll probably stand up from here. And the pad will probably go away, maybe. I don't know if that's just her tantrum pad that stays in place. <laughs> but I guess we can click on it. We go call a sign and it brings her to it. And so she can throw another fit whenever she wants to. <laughs> Not a happy girl. Okay. So there is number 16 level up. Now I think there is one more level up, or maybe there's even more. But see, I had start stopped a while back. But that was at 15. And I bought two gems thinking there was gonna be more, and it stopped for a long time. But um, this one was added. So I'm going to go ahead and see if there's any more, and I'll be doing some more if there is. And I think in the future here, I'm going to go over how to buy clothes and use the clothing HUD and use the clothing closet in greater detail just so everybody will get uh, the hang of that. But it's the Hat Mama with little Ileana and Second Life. Bye-bye. <laughs>